Assalamu alaikum ninjas and welcome back, welcome back, you ninja Muhammad with another GameSir gamepad review, GameSir G7 guys, a virate controller for Xbox and PC, remember that. Uh, this is, I'm not sure if you are going to be able to use it with Android, if you have a OTG obviously support with your phone, not every single phone has this support guys, but I think you should be able to even use it with some Android devices like tablets or uh, and uh, smartphones. Nevertheless, $45 on AliExpress with a promotion sale with additional... Uh, uh, plate which you can replace black and white guys which is very interesting this is the first time seeing something like this anyway let's begin with an unboxing the buying links in the description support my channel that way let's go let's go there we go guys so let me just show you what you receive in the box this here maybe because i'm a youtuber or maybe because the early bird uh, sale you're gonna receive uh, extra two uh, additional plates to uh, basically cover uh, this gamepad which is very very interesting uh, anyway we have a lot of sticks different uh, usual standard uh, uh, basically stuff with the game set also we have xbox game pass uh, i think for one month you're gonna receive it uh, in the box for 45 dollars that's very very cool uh, manuals we have game set uh, g7 manuals in different languages you can see the stuff over here check it out check it out uh, here we have this additional plate i think i think this is the same Oh, it's not the same. It's not the same. We have here Game Seal logo, but here we don't have games. Ah, we have a Game Seal logo. It's just uh, transparent. Or yeah, we call it like that. Nevertheless, in this, you're going to get in the box for free, guys. We have very long cable, guys. That's probably two meters, easily two meters cable, which is nice. That's very, very nice. I love what I'm seeing here. And uh, it seems that a great, great quality. And here we have the gamepad. Okay, just here we go. Quickie hands-on. A lot of stuff to uh, talk about this gamepad, guys. I love the grip. I love the design. I love the material used, magnetic interchangeable plates guys, I mean how cool is that? How cool is that? Check it out, I have four of them, uh, they added me two because of the pre-sale bird, if you obviously order this gamepad right now, you're gonna probably get for free also this additional plate, you can change, have black or white color, which is nuts guys. What I love about it guys, it has, uh, this is the first time I'm seeing, uh, I mean I already saw a mechanical gamepads, but for $45 all these specs, uh, this is the first time I'm seeing something like that. So yes, X, Y, A, B buttons are Mechanical buttons, that's ni very nice. Triggers, L1, R1. Very, goes, goes silent, guys. Unbelievably silent. Uh, this is one of the most silent gamepads that I tested so far. D-pad, nice. Triggers, very smooth, very clickable. Remember, it has four uh, motors inside of it. Four of them, guys. Remember that, four of them. Mic, uh, of course, mic mute, headphone jack there, 3.5 maybe headphone jack works completely fine. I'll be testing that and showing you. I mean, a great builded gamepad with customizable two buttons on the back. Plus this uh, finish grip on the here on the bottom. Love it, man. I love it, love it, love it. So I'll be already, already showing right now some PC games, gameplays, and uh, emulation gameplays. Uh, so far, I'll be also testing for the end with the Android smartphone, so we'll see what's going to happen. So anyway, guys, uh, what do we have? The cable itself is 3 me meters long. It's detachable USB-C cable, 3.5 mm, mm headphone jack with any headphones. Uh, it does work without any problems. Analog triggers are with the half effect magnetic sensors. We have analog, joy uh, analog joysticks, uh, ops, basically. ALPS, uh, rumble motors for in total in each grips and triggers, which I told you uh, just a few moments ago. It has two uh, mappable back buttons and Gamesir Nexus uh, customization software. Uh, remember, this doesn't have wireless support, so you can't use it as a Bluetooth or 2.4G, only wired support, guys. Remember that. And the net weight is 256 grams, which is similar to this smartphone over here in my hands, which is this Xiaomi Mi 11 Ultra, guys. Similar heaviness as a uh, classical flagship smartphone nice man seriously nice anyway so what else we can tell you about these uh, this gamepad uh, while you're watching uh, of course some gameplays in the background uh, I mean a lot of cool stuff the game set itself uh, for $45 uh, they they've done another ga amazing gamepad guys and most of the gamepads which I reviewed from this company are amazing uh, it's an ultra fast gamepad guys 256 hertz of polling rate and 0 0.004 second uh, seconds input latency so it's completely uh, unrecognizable 
visible. I mean, you need to be an AI robot to recognize this uh, delay, guys, which is insane. So no disassembly and magnetic, magnetic swappable. Swappable, remember that there are six magnets here, three on left side, three on the right side. So they are fully attached here. You're not going to have like slip problems, like it's going to slip or un un it, uh, de detach itself. No, it is gonna, not going to happen, guys. So far, I didn't have problems with this. That's also super cool. I repeat again, fully custom software customiza uh, customization. So you can customize the custom buttons on the back, the triggers, uh, of course, the, the sensitivity of the triggers, the XYB buttons. Maybe you want to swipe them. Everything is fully customizable, guys. So regarding the XYB A buttons, five layer structure, five million clicks lifetime, 0 0.6 millimeter actu actuation distance and 60 plus one plus minus 10 GF actuation force. Again, really crazy high performance triggers. We have zero fluctuation, zero deviation, zero circularity error and zero dead zone plus it has uh, uh, anti-fiction glide rings inside of it guys anyway these are all the heavy features i'm not going to bother you too much uh, uh, with all specs check it out there uh, of course uh, of course official website for now let's go now and show you more gameplays and let me just shut up regarding this gamepad regarding the hands-on that should be enough guys four minutes of talking about this gamepad that should be enough what a beautiful man feature what a beautiful feature that you can simply swap these uh, plates man Love it, love it. Let's go. Okay, Ninjas, we'll be testing firstly some PES game. And believe it or not, yes, I'm testing the headphones. They completely work, guys. Check it out. They work <laughs> without any problems whatsoever. I, I didn't need to install some software, some driver or anything, directly plug and play and that's it. Simple as it is with these cheap headphones, bro. Anyway, uh, I will be uh, removing these headphones because I want to listen to, and you guys can listen a little bit with me. Let's check this out. Let's go. Oh man, that looks very, very nice to be honest. GameSim produces amazing game pads, guys. They do have that drama with the Agon Simulator and the GameStar X series, but uh, nevertheless, before that, after that, uh, this is a really amazing Chinese company with an amazing uh, brand, bro. Amazing products. Uh, most of the game pads are really amazing. Ah, oh, nice. Let's go next, guys. Okay guys, here we go, here we go. Uh, Battlefield 3 runs just um, default, no no problems to install. I don't need to install any driver, no need to set up anything in the settings. It just simply works, guys. Check this out. Wow. Nice kill. Wow, the vibration is great, guys. The vibration is very nice, very strong. And it's not that, uh, let's just say, heavy or intrusive. Let me try to see, can I, how do I take the gun? Okay. I'm gonna do here. Killed me. Haha, <laughs> great game, bro. Let's go next. There you go, guys. Playing a little bit uh, Need for Speed at Underground 2, yeah? On default, guys. No need to set up anything in settings. Uh, just plug and play. That's it. Simple as it is. All of the play, uh, production games, you just need to go through the settings and change the triggers of L1 uh, uh, and L2, R1 and R2. Swipe them. I don't know why on default uh, that you need to change that and also XYB, uh, a, XYB a buttons of course. Woo! Nice. I'm gonna try to use uh, I'm gonna try to use maybe OTG just to test it to see will uh, it connect. I don't know. Maybe 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 we will see some surprise. But for now, Xbox and PC work with plug and play. Plug and play. Simple as it is. Check it out, guys. I love these mechanical buttons, guys. Uh, just enjoyable satisfaction just listening to these to these buttons, bro. Ah, wow, man. Amazing. Amazing. Seriously amazing. I love it. Anyway, let's go next with one more game. 
Okay, just I'm testing also RPCS, uh, RPCSX uh, PS2 emulator. Believe it or not, yes, uh, you can use this gamepad without any problems with emulators. That's the easiest ways to use uh, easiest ways uh, to use the wired gamepad, especially uh, Xbox gamepads or PlayStation gamepads uh, or some other classical wired gamepads uh, from a great brand. Uh, especially Game Series right now works without any problems whatsoever. Also, the vibration uh, motors work just fine here on default uh, with emulators, guys, and I already feel them when I don't know maybe I shoot uh, or when I'm hitting in the ground or when I yeah something like this guys uh, anyway we'll be testing some different games for now GTA works just fine with this gamepad okay guys check it out Tekken that's you checking out right now here the Tekken on 3k resolution here with the uh, RPC SX2 emulator uh, running full speed here amazing amazing performance but I'm using right now the ultra wide uh, uh, stretched hack option here with the simulator man this gamepad is just absolutely insane man uh, i don't know what to say man that's it's a it's a great gamepad bro it's a quality great gamepad it's not 100 dollars it's less than 50 bucks and uh, has all of this man included in this price tag love it you lose i lose continue guys i think that should be it i already tested some pc games tested some uh, emulation games right now uh, let's just for the Five, end try to see if the four, OTG works on Android. Three. Okay, just just uh, want to tell you that the OTG here connectivity doesn't work here with this gamepad with Android smartphones. I tried Samsung and Xiaomi, it doesn't work. I don't know if there's any other trick, but it doesn't work, guys. Uh, nevertheless, that should be it. Uh, I think my own impressions for the end, uh, uh, pure 10, guys. Pure 10, uh, uh, this is a budget gamepad, guys. This is not that expensive, bro. Like $45 for all of this. And you're going to get also this magnetic plate, which is interchangeable. Three meters of the quality great uh, cable. I mean, crazy stuff, guys. Plus 3.5 mm headphone jack, software customization. You can... Uh, uh, mute, unmute, uh, use option volume up and down, uh, customizable two buttons on the back, uh, crazy great stuff. I love it, man. Seriously, I love this gamepad. I highly recommend it for $45 right now on uh, early, bir uh, early bird uh, uh, pre-sale promotion. Get it, guys. Get it. It looks even impressive like this. But of course, I'm going to use it like that because of the magnets and everything. Just put the plate. Again, I'm going to show you right now here the white one. Just fit nicely. But I love the black one. I love the black one more. So, guys... The buying links will be in the description. Highly recommend this gamepad so far. I love it. Uh, also, the uh, the Xbox button works just fine with the Windows. I didn't show you that, but it works exactly the same as with the original Xbox gamepads. 45 bucks, guys. $45 works with the Xbox consoles and PC, uh, desktop, laptop, etc. etc. Master Lemon. Have a great day. Bye-bye.